after COVID hit, telehealth became a necessity to give access to people who couldn't come in person or when we even couldn't see people in person. Prior to COVID, it wasn't a thing. Insurance companies didn't cover it. We have the benefit of offering telehealth here and we continue to offer it because it gives access, convenience and safety for people who either can't or won't <laughs> come in to an in-person session. I think telehealth is so valuable because it's really meeting people where they are right now and meeting a person's emotional needs is one of the ways that we could do that. Sometimes people are more comfortable at home or more comfortable in their own home environment on a screen. And so they find that they can actually be more open. So I think that it really is up to what the client feels like they need and, and how they can best be served. I think telehealth is the most helpful for people when they are able to express what's going on with them. It is one of the best options we have when it comes to therapy for working professionals, for people with a really tight schedule. Some of my clients are parents, some of my clients talk to me on their lunch break, so it really helps that they don't have to come in the office. They can like go in their car, they can close their door, you know, they can talk during nap time and, and work out some things that are going on with them. So to get started with telehealth is just like getting started with an in-person counseling session. Go on our website and fill out an interest form or give us a call and say that you're interested in telehealth therapy. And they will help you set up, okay, what's the time that works for you? what time works for the clinician, and then make sure you have a device that works, like internet, and that's all you need. It's pretty easy. If you have a tablet, a phone, or a computer, you got it.